Hi everyone, it's your girl Lola Baby Lexi, and I'm here with another video. I am not trying to be too loud because everyone in the house is asleep. Um, I would say my roommate, my bestie, is asleep too, but um, she is not here right now. So I'm alone. The first day that I decide to come back home, she's not home. You see what I mean? Do you see what I mean? Like, what's the point of me being here if she's not here? If you guys don't know, I've been at my guy's place for like two, three weeks straight. Back to this whole vlog, <laughs> let me just clear everything up. He hasn't asked me out. We've been talking for five months, about to be six months actually, and he hasn't asked me out. <laughs> Hold up. Hold on, I need like a minute to process that because I've never waited this long. Never in my life have waited this long for a guy to ask me out or like waited this long in a talking stage. Like never in my life. Oh my gosh. I think I need a minute to cry. Okay, back to, um, <laughs> basically it is one in the morning and I cannot sleep. I literally need Felicity here. The reason why I need her here is because I was working on Tuesday, right? My last day working Tuesday, Wednesday. <sighs> he texts me and he's like, hey, don't pick up any shifts on Friday because I made reservations for you and me, so you're mine that day. And hold on, I, I have the proof. I have the proof. Um, it's right here. You see this? Okay, he didn't say you're mine, but he did say, don't make any, don't pick up any shifts. I have something for us to do. By the way, it is November 18th, and the back of my head, the only thing that's going in the back of my head is, <laughs> is today the day like is he gonna ask me out am i ready i am ready i like him like i like him a lot felicity's not here and i need someone to help me pick out an outfit and i don't know what to wear and i'm stressing out i don't know but you guys are gonna help me out pick an outfit okay sound all right sound good to you okay so this is the dress number one okay this is dress number two i know you guys can't see my face but this is dress number two. I am like literally shivering. I could feel goosebumps all over myself right now. Okay, so this was the third dress. I think it's super cute, but I'm scared that like it might just like undo by itself. Is this see-through? Is this see-through? Is this see-through? Okay, my boobies don't fit. Outfit number two is this one. Okay, when I say I lost weight, I lost weight to the point that my bitties got small. So these are the pants that I wore for my birthday. If you guys saw my birthday vlog, then you know what the pants look like in person. Oh, well, not in person, but you already know what they look like in daylight. They're just black jeans, you know, whatever. I like this, but I don't know. I kind of like the top, though. But I do have to wear a bra because if you guys can't tell... Someone's being nosy. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to be the fit. I feel like it's a yes. I like it. Like, these are comfy. I love this. This is just a tank top. A red tank top. I'm not going super, like, oh, like, or whatnot. It's more like, cute. This Well, good afternoon. <laughs> it's like 2 p.m. I have to go take a shower. I just woke up. I'm gonna go take a shower and then I will be back. So honestly, I thought we were going out to eat and that's why I was like, oh, he's probably not gonna ask me out, right? Well, I'm wrong because he gets off at 7 and our reservations is at 8. So now I'm kind of nervous, like, is today the day? Like, is he asking me out today? Like... Wait, don't get your hopes up. Do not get your hopes up. Stop. I am looking at myself in the mirror. Don't think I'm crazy. He's having me order online, and then we're going to go pick it up after work. If we're not going out to eat, where are we going at 8? I'm kind of scared. 
scared. <laughs> What's going on here? He just called me, he's on his way, and I gotta go get my shoes, which is in the car, and my jacket, which is in the car too. So yeah, <laughs> I'm nervous. Mm, I'm gonna go barefooted. If you guys don't know, this is the first place. This is the first place. Oh my god, my camera sucks ass. <laughs> this is the first day place the not the first place. The beach was the first place we ever went to together. And then this was the second place. But the same day we came here. And this is the first place that he ever kissed me. And he asked me to be his girlfriend today at the same place. They're pretty. And I've been crying all day today. <laughs> Complaining, crying, and everything. <laughs> I'm eating this in like five seconds when I come back. <laughs> Set these back there. And then he called me ghetto because there's no vase here and I don't want these flowers to die. That is good. <laughs> but honestly, I was thrown off the whole day today. I was, I didn't tell you guys, but I had so many emotions today. Like, I had so many emotions today. I was crying, happy, laughing, mad, nervous, nervous, anxious, all of that. Surprisingly, I didn't ruin it. I was so surprised. Because the whole time I was like, you haven't asked me out. Like, why haven't you asked me out? Like, this and that. I was being a little petty. and Well, not petty. But I was being a B to him because I was upset with the fact that he didn't ask me out yet. And I literally thought like today he was gonna ask me out. And then later on I was like, he's not asking me out today. And then this dude surprises me and asks me out today. <laughs> <laughs> I honestly didn't get the part of me like walking in and crying to it because I was so like surprised when I seen it. I just like for totally forgot about my camera. like. It was just in the moment that I forgot and I was just like, what's the word? In shock. I was in shock. Cause when I say like I've never had any guy like do exactly what he did. There's this one day I went live and I wrote on his whiteboard uh, some rules, not rules, but um, some chores to do kinda. Some missions that he had to complete. And one of them was like, ask out Alexis to be your girlfriend, like officially, properly. On the whiteboard, he did misspell beautiful. <laughs> it's okay though. I think it's so cute. So path to success. Number one, ask the most beautiful girl out. And when I seen that, he, he was like, oh, I already did that. And then he like check marked it off. And then number two is keep her in your life with a smiley face, which is so cute. And I was just thinking about it because when I was in San Diego, I had sent him a picture when we were first talking and it was something about like success, right? And it said rule number one, don't tell anyone everything you know. And then number two was blank. Like it was two rules. It was like two rules to success, to being successful. Num number one, don't be telling anyone everything you know. And number two was blank. That was it. Like nothing there, you know? And I sent it to him, and he was like, what's, in, what's rule number two? And I was like, me, dummy. <laughs> and I was just thinking about that right now, because it says, like, path to success. What did I say for number two? I mean, that part can't even go up, so you're going to have to edit that shit out. I know, but what did I say for number two? Uh, for number two, you said... Uh, for rule number two. I forgot to you don't remember it? 
I said rule number two <laughs> is, is me. Yeah. yeah. Like, and you know what you put? You put the dead emoji. I have the proof still. And matter of fact, I'm putting it right here. You guys see this? Because, man, I'm dead. <laughs> Do you see this? This is what he sent me. But it's okay, because we were barely talking at that time, so I was just like, I'm going to let it slide. But the next time he puts dead emoji to me, I'm going to throw a brick at his head, because I don't know who you dead emoji, but it's just not me. This is going to be the end of the video. I love you all. <laughs> um, toodles. Toodles. <laughs> no, not toodles.